Hey guys, how are you? Daniel Marcos here from Austin. I was uh, just going to bed and I was lying in my bed reading this article. And this guy was saying that in the future, the biggest way to predict the future of success of someone is if they're below the API or above the API. Uh, and I first said like, this guy's crazy. And then I kind of continued reading. And wow, this guy is brilliant. So, so let me kind of explain. He said, the API or the way the systems connect with each other, let's say an algorithm with another algorithm, there's going to be two types of executives. Executives are people that live below the API or the algorithm, or they live above the API. So imagine, let's say Uber. You could work building Uber, programming Uber, designing Uber, or you could work being an Uber and working below the API. The biggest predictor of success is if you live or work on top of the API or the algorithms. And I thought that was brilliant. So you could be two things. You're the creative executive and the one running the platforms or the one that is going to be run by the platforms, that your life is going to depend on the platform and you're going to be chasing the platform. The platform is going to tell you what to do and you're going to follow that. Like Amazon, right? You could live on top of the platform, putting the products, designing the user experience, doing all the buttons for people to buy, whatever. Or you're going to live below delivering the things that people buy in Amazon. I thought that was brilliant. Everything in the world is going to be systems and platforms. And there's going to be two types of executives. The ones that live on top, that have creative work and really building it and designing it. And the people that live below and their life is going to be dictated or run by the algorithms and the platforms. And this I connect with something I read the other day. That someone was saying, there's going to be two types of businesses in the future. There's going to be platforms and businesses that depend on the platform. Amazon is an amazing platform. How many small businesses live by or depend on Amazon? As an example, my platform or my company today, we invest a lot of dollars every month in Facebook, LinkedIn, and all the platforms, right? We advertise and that's why we win clients. So it's two types of businesses. You're going to own Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter, and the rest, or you're going to be one of the businesses that depend on Amazon, LinkedIn, whatever. So as an entrepreneur, the one thing that is going to determine your success or how big your success is going to be is if you're going to build the platforms and the algorithms, or you're going to be one of the businesses that depend on the platform and the algorithms. And as an executive, it's going to depend if you work below the platform and the platform and the algorithms will tell you what to do and you will just react and follow directions on the platform. Or you're going to be on top and you're going to be a creative executive that is going to build the platform. I, I, I thought this guy was brilliant, was a, an investor from Silicon Valley uh, that was explaining this. And if you connect that with the two types of businesses, that just gives you as an entrepreneur, as an executive, where do you want to be? And it's going to be very, very clear who's going to win big time. Whoever builds the algorithm and the platforms or whoever lives by the algorithm and the platforms. Best way to predict the future. Where do you want to be? Up here or down here? You could decide. <laughs>